Oh, there you go. Oh, fish on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, another fish on. Get up. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Yeah, boy. You tell me. 14 or 15. Look at that. Good morning and welcome to another episode. Today we're doing some kayak fishing. But before we head to the water, we have a nice product that you guys are going to be interested in. Let's open the package, talk a little bit about the product, then we're going to hit the water. There you go, guys. That's Trapino retraceable ratchet straps and included we have four heavy duty soft loops let's see what's in the box okay you have all the info here we thought we were receiving only two but they were nice enough, they sent us four of these beautiful, heavy-duty, retraceable straps. So, before we get to that, those are my old, like you see, tangly. The hooks are not safe, so they're gone. That's what we're going to be using lately, guys. And we see that clip, you'll know why you need to cross the company, heavy-duty straps, and good-looking and retraceable makes it easy you don't need to go around the car 300 times all right you guys so you know that that's not a clickbait driving north on 275 uh, northbound a kayak flew into my car right on my hood smashed the passenger side uh, windshield and the mirror and ended up on the right side of the highway that's why uh, uh, the previous video I made about KYX uh, roof rack and uh, kayak carrier guys it's better to be safe and sorry uh, that's what this video today is about it's about strapino straps that's why you have to secure your load like kayaks or whatever you carry so you avoid these kind of accidents so let's open one of these guys I like it already that's what I was talking about this uh, S uh, shape hook with a clip with securing clip you clip this in your uh, heavy duty soft loops I never use the retraceable uh, ratchet so this is new for me just open the box like you see it's not that I tried them before but it's not a rocket science they make it so easy guys I guess smooth as a butter that's what you want when you looking for straps Okay, the way it works, you have to go 90 degree up, just like that, and you just go in one side, kayak roof rack, just secure your hook, clip it in that side, and you just get this all around, top of your kayak, in my case it's a kayak, you guys can have whatever load you want, come in my side, put the other hook in the other end of the kayak carrier click this again and then like any other ratchet you just smooth as a butter guys retrace it where you want it secure enough click it down and you're ready to go just like that it's no extra time no tangling no problem breaking strength at 1500 pounds which is a lot working load limit is 500 pounds or 227 kilogram so even if you say working load 500 that don't mean you cannot have anything heavier yes you can because it's say breaking strength till 1500 pounds which is a lot but just to be safe or to be on safe side that's the working load that they recommend which is 500 pounds 227 kilogram uh, length of the straps are 10 feet which is plenty 3 meters the box comes with four or the box that I'm reviewing that I'm gonna link down on my description comes with four retraceable ratchet straps and it comes with four heavy-duty soft loop straps let's check the loops as well it's gonna go around 
the roof rack and you're gonna bring them together like that and that's where the hook comes in place secure this with a clip and you're good to go guys so let's go in the car demonstrate this in the car and see how fast this is going to be all right you guys we're here on the car now so we got our ratchet the retraceable ratchet like always click the red one go completely up and now you're free to just go as far as 10 feet so what we do first put this two times around and we're gonna take our S hook secure it Let's see. I went two times because I want this short I don't want this that long so I want this to stay in the air like that and we're gonna go in the other side of the kayak just like that just like that easy simple we're gonna make sure that we have it on the right position right there just like that straight see that's the idea of a retraceable uh, strap guys you don't get tangled or anything same thing with the other soft loop I'm gonna make them I'm gonna go one time around because you can it depends what you're loading but this is too long for me so that's the idea that going two times around making this little short the clips you're gonna lock it so you don't have to worry about anything just like that and now you're gonna click again go to the same position and start tying it just like that Don't over tie, always just just tie it enough where your kayak is safe and secure. See how easy this is guys? And when we go to our fishing spot, simple as that. I'm gonna click, let go, retraceable. That's the idea guys. All right you guys, like you see, good looking straps. Took me less than a minute and take you 20 seconds to take them off. Just release retrace the straps and it's it so see you guys in the water so we're ready we got some pinfish since it's late we're not uh going uh to search the flats for redfish or snook we're gonna go straight for the bridge drop some pinfish there let's hit the bridge and catch some fish it's impossible guys to uh to anchor uh the current is crazy strong i have to tie myself on the pants not the best current to come kayaking on uh, on the bridge. I prefer close to a slack high tide here. Fish that half an hour before high tide and half an hour after, and that's all. And after that, it gets crazy. I just got here. Ah, uh, thanks. I just grabbed a small pinfish for now. One odd circle hook. Two odd circle hook will be fine too. If this is too small. Now we're gonna go where we think. The current is gonna take us right where I used to catch snappers. So let's see if they're there. After this we're gonna try Mohara. Let's see if they're in the mood for Mohara. Evening hours. It's hit or miss. I don't really come in this area in the evening hour, so I don't know if it's good or bad. I don't know if that's fish or is that curve. Come on. Fish on. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a good one. Finally. Wow, first fish and it's a keep up. Found snapper. It's tough though, it's tough to feel that, uh, it's tough to feel that bite. So deep in here, current so strong. Uh, 
first snappy and it's a keeper guys there you have it I'll say like 11 and a half you can measure stop it 11 incher we'll take it let's drop another one I'm doing since the current is crazy strong I'm throwing all the way on the right side and till he gets where I want him to get kind of in the bottom let's do it again let's see if that theory works let's throw it all the way there in the line if there is one snapper for sure that's more. Lock it. And let's see now. And we have two in a row. Fish up. Wow. Second fish of the day. Let's see what this is. Another snappy. Not bad, not bad. This is a short one. Snappy number two. See you. Drop another one. So far I like it. That was on a small pin fish. This is Mohara now. Let's see how long this Mohara. Seems like it's working. Too wavy and currently here. I don't like it much. I don't I don't think it's that safe. But hey, we'll make it work. There you go. Fish off just like that. Ah, is it go or is it small? I don't know. Oh, no, actually it's not small. Oh yeah, it's fighting now. It's not small. I thought it was small but not small. Let's see if he's gonna make 11. We're not gonna even bother, he's in the tent. Fish number three, guys. Yeah, we found them. I want to drop the second line with bigger pinfish, but since I'm in tight spot here, I only can work one uh, one rod at a time. Later on, I'll give that a try again. See if anything bigger there. But for now. Just working the snappers. Let's see. Three in a row. Do that and the current and the rocks, of course. There's a lot of rocks on the bottom. You get stuck left and right. That was a good one. Come on, take it. Stop playing with me. There he goes. Show him. Not that big. Step on number four. Where are the big ones? Come on, go and tell your mama to come. Come and visit us. Tell her fish on is here. He wants to talk to you. I guess not a lot of big ones there. That's what it is. Fish up. Feels good. Oh yeah. Oh come on. Oh, stop, stop. 
Might be a good snapper. Or maybe a small group. Oh no, that's a nice snap. That's what we're looking for. There you have it. Yeah. 12 half. We'll take it. 12 half. I think it's the fourth snapper. I'm not sure I lost count. Fourth or fifth. Let's throw another uh, nice size pinfish in there. Catch another. Here you go. That's the size of the pinfish I'm working with. I think those big snappers like this size of the pinfish. There you have it. Perfect size. Let's send another one. Oh, that's a good one. Get out. This is another good one. I have to get them up before they uh, rock us. Oh, that's a fatty one. Oh, that's fatty. Whoa. Finally, we found those fat ones. I didn't even bother measuring. It's in the 12 half 13 as well. They're eating those uh, medium sized pinfish. Man, I'm pumped. Put that on the box and go for another one. Finally, we found those fat snappers. So hard to feel the bottom here. Oh, there he goes. Oh, fish on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, another fish one. Get up. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Yeah, boy. Oh, yeah, that's even bigger. Come on, come up. Come up, come up. Oh, 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 oh. That's a thing. That's a thing. Oh, no. they even getting bigger, guys. They getting bigger. Tell me, 14 or 15? Look at that. That fatty, that's what we came here for. Whoa. They bite in these uh, evening hours, like uh, 40 minutes before sunset. All right, you guys, we're calling it all for today. It's almost sunset and I don't have proper lights on my kayak. It's been like three weeks uh, for me since I did kayak, since my car was on the shop. So I'm happy my car is fixed. I'm out kayaking catching fish can beat that and thanks again to strapino retraceable ratchet straps thank you for sending these beautiful need straps took me 40 seconds to tie my kayak and 10 seconds to release so it only takes 50 seconds to one minute of your time my old straps i was taking forever so that's time that i want to spend out on fishing so that's all we got for you today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to like, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and I'll see you on the next one.